Jason, the Clinical Development Coordinator here at REMSA. May is Stroke Month, and we want you to know the signs and symptoms of a stroke and what to do in an emergency. Strokes are caused either by the sudden loss of blood flow to the brain from a clot or a ruptured blood vessel bleeding inside of the head. When this blood flow stops, brain cells stop functioning or begin to die. As a result, the activities of the body controlled by dying brain cells can lose their ability to function. You can learn the basic symptoms of a stroke by following the FAST, F-A-S-T, warning signs. FAST warning signs of a stroke are, F stands for facial drooping. Ask the person to smile. Is the person's smile uncharacteristically uneven or do they report face numbness? A stands for arm weakness. Ask the person to raise both arms. Is one arm weak? Are they unable to raise the arm? Or do they report numbness to their arm? Or does one arm drift downward? Speech, S stands for speech. Ask the person to repeat a simple sentence such as the sky is blue. Is the person unable to speak or hard to understand or have slurred speech? T stands for time to call 911. If the person you are interacting with shows any of the signs and symptoms above, even if the symptoms go away, call 911 immediately. It's also advised that you check the time to know when the first symptoms appeared or the patient's last known well time. Even if the signs and symptoms of a stroke seem to resolve themselves, it is still advisable that you call 911 immediately or quickly visit an emergency room. When someone suffers from a stroke, the potential for brain cell damage increases with every moment that passes. This is why it is critically important that you call 911 the moment that you think someone is having a stroke. From all of us here at REMSA, be well.